Welcome back one and all to Travel by Turtles. In this video, we'll be taking you on a journey through a tropical paradise in the lands that time forgot. When visiting the Cayman Islands, there's no map that you have to follow in order to discover what makes this destination extraordinary, because it's obvious from the moment you arrive. Do it all, or do nothing, other than savor the spectacular views, the warmth of the people, and the perfect weather. Either way, you won't be disappointed with your choice. The laid-back atmosphere, hotels, resorts, and villas combine perfectly with the islands, ready to be explored at your own pace. That's what makes it so different from your typical mega-resort-style vacation. Visit for the local festivals, the delectable seafood, the pristine-kept beaches, or snorkeling and diving in the waters teeming with life. Watch the hustle and bustle from the seat of a beachside bar, or swaying in a hammock along a perfect shoreline. The enticing activities featured in today's tour will be all the direction you need to start your joyous journey. So grab your sunglasses and your snorkel gear and follow us through these top 10 to-dos in the extraordinary Cayman Islands. Number one, snorkeling and diving. The Cayman Islands have world-class snorkeling and scuba diving thanks to the incredible underwater visibility, rich sea life, and healthy coral reefs. With shallow coves and sandbars, barrier reef systems, and an abundance of sea creatures, the islands are home to some of the best snorkeling in the Caribbean. With the exception of the Kitawake shipwreck, snorkeling and diving on your own throughout the Cayman Islands is free, if you can secure your own gear. Guided trips, with transportation and gear included, start at around $40 per person for group tours and rise to $500 plus for a private boat charter. Number two, Stingray City. This once in a lifetime experience lets you get up close to these magnificent animals. Aquatic lovers can mingle with marine life by wading among friendly stingrays that congregate near the sandy shore. Experience the majestic Southern Atlantic stingrays in only three feet of water as you brush up against these lovely creatures. During the tours, you can swim with, feed, and take memorable photos with these friendly rays. And don't worry, despite their name, these stingrays are completely harmless. Number three, explore Seven Mile Beach. This stunning stretch of sand is known for its warm, turquoise waters and gentle waves, making it perfect for some fun on the water. Whether you're looking to swim, surf, jet ski, or snorkel, the options are endless. And because of the calm waves and shallow reefs found along many parts of Seven Mile Beach, stand-up paddleboarding is an ideal way to take in all the area has to offer. Other popular water sports here include kiteboarding, windsurfing, and kayaking. If you're looking for opportunities to relax and refresh, the beach is lined with dining and entertainment activities for every traveler's preference. Number four, visit the Cayman Islands capital, Georgetown. Georgetown is the capital of the Cayman Islands and is a great place to explore. With its colorful buildings, lively markets, and bustling streets, you'll feel like you've stepped into a different world. And if you're a fan of shopping, You'll love the variety of stores and boutiques that line the streets. From luxury brands to local souvenirs, you'll find it all in Georgetown. Number five, take a catamaran tour. If you want to see the Cayman Islands from a wider perspective, a catamaran tour is a must. With its gentle swaying and stunning views, these pleasant tours are the perfect way to relax and take in the beauty of the island. And with a variety of options available, you can choose one that suits your interests, whether that's snorkeling, island hopping, or just enjoying the views. Number six, visit the Cayman Turtle Farm. This is a unique attraction that lets you learn about the island's native sea turtles and their conservation efforts. You'll be able to see turtles of all sizes and learn about their life cycle and habitat. And if you're lucky, you might even get to hold a baby turtle. The Cayman Turtle Farm is not only a fun and educational experience, but it's also a great way to support the conservation efforts of these amazing creatures. Number seven, take a helicopter tour. If you want to see the Cayman Islands from a bird's eye view, a helicopter tour has to be on your to-do list. Showing off the incredible island terrain and natural variety, this perspective will give you a new appreciation for the beauty of the Cayman Islands. 
Whether you want to see the stunning beaches, the lush forests, or the bustling city, a helicopter tour is the perfect way to experience it all. Number 8. Visit the Queen Elizabeth II Botanical Park. This beautiful and tranquil oasis in the heart of the Cayman Islands, with its lush gardens and stunning displays of local flora and fauna, is the perfect place to relax and escape the busy feel of the more populated areas. Whether you're a fan of nature or just want to escape the sun for a bit, the Botanical Park might just be what you're looking for. Number 9. Take a Glass Bottom Boat Tour These tours are a unique and fun way to explore the underwater world. With its clear view of the coral reefs and marine life below, you'll be able to see the beauty of the island's waters without getting wet. And with a knowledgeable guide on board, you'll learn fascinating details about the island's rich history and diverse ecosystem that surrounds you. Number 10. Visit the Cayman Craft Market. This bustling and colorful market showcases the best of the culture in Cayman. It's the perfect place to pick up a unique and authentic reminder of your trip, like a new piece of jewelry, a handmade pottery piece, or just a fun local souvenir. So set aside some time before you leave to visit the Cayman Craft Market. The Cayman Islands are incredibly diverse and offer an endless array of sights and activities to enjoy. Please, come ready to get wet. While there are many options for entertainment and relaxation on the island itself, the surrounding waters are the real treasure of this beautiful destination. By the way, here's a bit of insight that might help you plan your vacation. Wondering about a good season to visit? Is there ever a bad time to sample some delicious chocolate? Cayman is always ready for visitors. After all, air and sea temperatures have little variation throughout the year. It's always summer in the Caribbean. But some of you prefer dark chocolate, chocolate with nuts, or chocolate that's fruit-infused. And similarly, if you are looking for special distinctions, like an off-season, it may indeed matter when you choose to visit. The high season for the Cayman Islands is from mid-December through mid-March. This is when lodging, tours, and activities have both the highest booking rates and the least availability. So if you want to come during this season, it's crucial to plan and book ahead. You might also be wondering about hurricanes, which is a natural concern in the Caribbean. The greatest chance of hurricanes affecting the Cayman Islands is from September through November. Although that certainly doesn't mean the islands are closed up. You can still visit and likely enjoy a less expensive trip. Fortunately, there hasn't been a major disturbance from hurricanes on Grand Cayman in nearly 20 years. Arguably, the best time to visit is during the shoulder season, when the crowds are less, costs are down, and the threat of storms is minimal. This sweet spot season falls squarely between the months of early May and late August. So if you're looking for your next adventure or relaxing escape, start planning your ultimate adventure in the Cayman Islands today. Leave a comment to let us know what we missed or what you love here in Cayman the most. And enjoy your trip, whether you plan to cruise by catamaran, meander by motorboat, or travel by turtles.